and the big night has arrived. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray. My co-commentator to help describe all the action is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time here. It's Manchester United against Feyenoord. Well, Derek, this should be a top-class game between two excellent teams. Whoever gets control of that midfield area should win the game, but I think this is too close to call. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea starts in goal. Harry Maguire plays alongside Raphael Varane in central defence. Marcus Rashford starts with Mason Greenwood on the flanks. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. And this is how the lineup looks for Feyenoord. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. Doing well to keep possession. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Rashford unable to hold it. And the cross is very much on. Cuts it back. Now delivering that deep cross. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses really, was it? Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, he's been great. Oh, wait a minute. They could be in here. Shaw. Wonderfully weighted pass. Defended well. Linsen. Teal. Luis Sinistera. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Crossing possibilities. A really sound goalkeeping. Well, that's such a good save, isn't it? How did he keep that one out? Over it comes. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Not a time for composure on the ball. Rafael Varan. Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. And he's in. Given away by Manchester United.
strong but fair tackle. Will it happen for them? The opening goal in the final! And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. One nil then. Bruno Fernandes. This is Varane. Mason Greenwood. A running room galore for United. Chance to play it in. McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. McTominay. It's with McTominay. At times they make passing look easy. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Fred with it. Bruno Fernandes. Counter-attacking very much an option. And a chance to level it. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. He's given us away. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Jens Tornstra. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. It comes to absolutely nothing. And with that, the first half draws to a close. The quest for Europa League success. And the second half of this final is underway. Bruno Fernandes. Here's Ronaldo. Playing advantage here. United keep it. Mason Greenwood. Scott McTominay. Cristiano Ronaldo. Rashford. McTominay. Terrific block. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Here's 
there's a change for Manchester United. And over comes the corner. Just the clearance that was needed. Well, beaten easily here. Oh, a goal! As they forge ahead on this massive occasion, feel the passion. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So there we have it. 2-1. Sinisterra. Oh, this is looking promising. Excellent ball towards the front post. Well, the danger is still there. Oh, he's blocked it. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Bruno Fernandes. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Oh, lovely way to the ball. They might be in. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, let's look at the replay. They move the ball so well, just waiting for an opening. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So back underway at 3 1. That's a lovely ball. Gernot Trauner. Teal. Pedersen. And space for the cross. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Clean challenge. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Firing it towards goal. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, here it is again, and he controls this shot so well. That's a really good half volley and an excellent goal. So the action underway once more, and it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Well, not far away from full-time now, and United excelling here. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. A real defensive commitment there. And this situation could be... Now the task is to remain focused. Well, they pulled one back, but 
perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Bruno Fernandes. Pogba has it. And just five minutes remaining. Bruno Fernandes has it. And here is Malassia. Kukchu. Malassia. This looks promising. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Juan Bisaka. And then the whistle this UEFA Europa League final has been decided and my goodness they deserve it disappointment on one side but sheer jubilation on the other well relief and joy I would say what a great achievement this is and so well deserved as you mentioned they were excellent tonight what a good performance that was the party can certainly start now that's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. They're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, these are always great moments for any player. This is the culmination of a great tournament they've had. They fully deserve this victory. Every player played his part tonight. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League. Well, wonderful scenes. The players are making the most of this. It's been a great competition for them. And I think they have every intention of making this last as long as possible. One more trophy left. Why not? Yes. And now they get to enjoy the moment.